Welcome back awesome Action Toy fans and subscribers. So a little while ago I reviewed this rather awesome Stag Beetle which comes from like a egg toy. Rather rather large. Now if I do it from body not from feet to claws you see that that is around about five 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 inches. That is a big toy. Uh, awesome as a monster for your fantasy in 118, 112, even 16. That's huge. That's bigger than life size. Uh, well, today I'm looking at the same brand egg to it again. This should be a giant hornet. So I am really looking forward to this. They are really, really nice stuff. And it does come with a flight stand. This one comes with a flight stand too, but I managed to snap it, which wasn't very clever of me. Okay, so I'm going to open this up, build this, turn the camera around, and we can take a look. Let's get into this. Oh my, that is phenomenal. That is so good. Really, really nice looking. And it's oops, huge. Why did my little demon decide to fall off there? Scared of a big wasp or hornet, probably. That is massive. And overbalancing there. I could do that a bit better. But that is really big. Give an idea. Uh, in fact, I'll, have a, I'll take it off for these little stand ears. Have a look at some of the articulation details. Give you a closer look. So, nice colouring. Good wings. Got the feet there. The mandibles, the jaws are articulated. So you can close them if you want. Or you can obviously open them. You could grip them around something. Oops, one just fell off there. You could grip them around something if you wanted two as well they're relatively stiff there's the open jaws get a bit of a better focus there nice big eyes and tender don't have any movement the head has a side to side up and down so it's a full motion the head the body has a uh, joint so you can fly for stinging if you open up the bottom section the stinger comes out that is quite scary but there's no real good place to plug the uh, flight stand in. I mean, I could do it from on top, I guess, but that's still going to fall over. Maybe that would work on that grip over that. Let me have a quick try. Yeah, it's still going to fall over. That's like a scary beast. Do you imagine? In fact, you want to imagine something like this flying towards Let me just change that flight stand at a second so I can get a more uh, balanced pose. And this should do it this way like this okay that is a scary scary big hornet that's talk about murder hornet death hornet that is the thing you know i think you got that flying towards you you definitely want to i mean that's a big thing imagine you want eight in scale my uh the reno guy's gonna have to uh definitely shoot that out the sky just to stay safe protect the uh Innocent lives. That is a great looking hornet. Um, I should also say there's articulation in the back part as well. So it's not just the waist that bends. All these little parts here have articulation. So you can get his stinger all the way around. Now that will pop out if you keep pushing it too hard. But that's a fantastic uh, model. The only thing I will say, the legs are not strong enough to really support his weight. If it's in a flat walking mode, one just dropped out there. Um, which is a bit of a shame. But if I have this more flat, get the legs in a more different sort of a walking posture, more splayed out. It just looks a bit, I guess it's okay, it looks a bit strange. Let's get his head cut out this way. But that is fantastic. Get his wings level as well fantastic flying beastie i think that looks fantastic and again if i go for a uh, height comparison wise in this mode not in his flying mode i use my same the arena sentinel with the uh, fade head from fortnite it is a large beastie for sure i think that is a fantastic model i've actually i actually bought two actually i think i pre-ordered another one as well but I don't know if I want to pre-order it and pay the small deposit. I'm not sure if I'll pay the rest. I think two is enough. Unless I'm going to go for like a wasp army or something. But that is a scary, scary beastie. 
definitely not something you want to be seeing on a summer's day or any day for that matter. You want your one of your sharp shooters here to uh get that out the sky so you are safe. Fantastic. I really like that. Recommended. I'll give you a quick look at the instructions. It is by Bandai and it says it's a gashapon on there. G-A-S-H-A-P-O-N. Let me focus on this. Let's see gashapon there. There's a QR code. Not sure if you guys can scan that and a web address. HTTP semicolon slash slash www.gashapon.jp and another one down there too, and another QR code is ABSPVCPOM, that's what POM is, uh, made in China. Surprise, surprise, and then there's the instructions at the back. There's more than one type, so I'm not sure if my other one is the other type or the same, but it's just slightly different colouring. Either way, I think that is a fantastic looking toy. Let me see if I can zoom in a little bit on this. Okay, so a slightly closer look. Very, very menacing. You've got a phobia. You don't want to be like one of these. <laughs> Looks fantastic. Okay, please click on the notification icon and subscribe if you've not done so already. And check out my other videos. And I'll be back soon with more awesome actual video reviews for you guys. Stay happy. Keep collecting. Bye-bye.